So, Fall of Cadia Battle 16. Now this one is a bit of a doozy. It's, um, you'll need to use Yazagor for this. I found when I was doing it the first time, but you need his passive unlocked. So mine's only Iron 1, which means he can't take a hit at all. If he gets hit, he's dead. So you really, really need to be able to clear the field of enemies quickly and make sure that this bastard Laz Cannon here can't get a shot off on him which is easier said than done, but it can be done. So, let's get into it. And yes, this um, positioning is not random, and you'll see why in a moment. First up, I'm going to move Harkon up here. And he will have to eat a Laz Cannon shot, but he's a big boy, he can take it, sort of. He can take one. Now, things get a little awkward here, but the main thing we want is for the Voxcasters to be killed. And we can manage that just fine. Well, first things first. Let's take care of this guy. Now, the pink horror here, wherever you put it, it's only going to be able to melee, so it's not not ideal, but the Voxcaster is the weakest target, so put it next to the Voxcaster and that way we'll have Screamers properly hitting these Guardsmen here. So that's good. Now, because we hit three targets with Psychic Attacks, um, Yazgore's passive has kicked in, so we can now move five spaces up to here, which is perfect. We want to swap with Abraxas. So, hit the Voxcaster. Abraxas is now up there. And we can hit this Cadian. Don't count on turning him into a Bloodletter, of course, but that worked out nicely. And those Voxcasters should die regardless of how good uh, Archimatos, um, sorry, Abraxas' active is. As long as it's level 26, I think. I've had no problem with this. Now, the trouble you'd have on this map at this point, if you hadn't done what I have done, is that you'd have guys here, which stops you from moving your Angrax here. The reason this is important is because if you don't move Angrax here, this Laz Cannon will be able to move forward the space and take out Yazagor. But as it stands, he can only sort of sit there and do nothing and die. But if I hadn't have done that, the Azgore would have been taken out very easily. So it's very important that you do exactly what I did, pretty much. Okay, 